Hello, penguins and friends. This week we are celebrating family. Friday we're having family fiesta and we've been talking about families. How we have our own families and certain animals too, right, have their type of family. I wanted to share with you um, my postcard writing. I'm going to send a postcard to my family and they won't necessarily get it by the time of our family fiesta, but they will get it. What I need to send them, in this case, a postcard, which has Coney Island, uh, it's Coney Island themed. I got it in Coney Island last summer, actually, and I, I did, I was going to keep it, I'm sort of waffling. Do I keep it? Do I send it? I kept it, but now might be the perfect time to send it. It says Coney Island. Brooklyn, New York. And a lot of you have been here. I've heard some of you talk about going there and enjoying being at the beach or walking the boardwalk or riding the rides. This one, I'm going to guess, might be a little too, um, too crazy and wild for some of the penguins and friends, but um, they have all kinds of rides there, don't they? It's very fun. So that's the picture on there roller coaster at Coney Island, Brooklyn, New York. And on the back, you'll see, it says here, postcard, <laughs> um, and stamp. So you put the stamp here. I have the stamps. It just needs one, uh, but it comes, you can buy them separately or you can buy them in a packet. And so this is a 20 post um, stamp packet. And they just peel right off like a sticker. And the sticky or the gummy part you put here and that means you paid for it and the postal worker will take it wherever it says to go right here this is the address box and this on this side if you can see there's a line here and lines here put the address here this side you write your letter or draw your picture or whatever you want to write so I was going to make this for my mom and dad. So I'm going to write, Dear Mom and Dad. I know some of you guys are working on your, your letters, so this might be something that you want to do, is write a letter. Or write, start working on writing Mom and Dad, and then you could draw something underneath. Because I might draw something, I hadn't decided. Dear Mom and Dad. Not letters, a taco. Ha! So I'm going to put a taco on there. I'm going to put tomatoes on there. They're going to have to imagine this a little bit. They'll work with me on it. Because I don't think I can color in on this. I think it will um, not, sh not uh, show up. So they're going to have to imagine that this is a taco with lots of tomatoes and lettuce. And I'm going to write on there, T-A-C-O, on the taco. See the letters? T-A-C-O, taco. Then, I'm going to make a little joke. I'm going to make that taco part of a sentence. And I'm going to say, let's talk about taco about how much I love you XO Sally let's talk about how much I love you XO Sally now so, haha, <laughs> a little cheerful joke there. And then I'm going to write the address here. And I'll keep that private. I won't show that to you guys. But the stamp, this is the fun part. You don't even have to lick these stamps. When I was a kid, you had to lick the stamp 
and lick the, um, well, if you're using an envelope, you had to lick the envelope, and now it has a gummy on it. You don't even have to lick it. See? It's sticking to my finger. It's not flying around. It's got that sticky gummy stuff on it. I'm going to put it right where it says to put it, and you put that, even if there's not a little box for it, you put it right there. So this is the upper right corner, even for an envelope. Same place. It's ready to go, except I can't take it to the mailbox yet until I put the address in. So I'll do that, and then I'll walk it to the one of the blue boxes, and I'll put it in there. I encourage you to maybe make a a message with pictures or whatever you want, the letters you're working on for your, your family this week. All right, much love.